Welcome to This Is Important, a production of iHeartRadio, the show where we only talk about what is most obviously very crucially important. Today on This Is Important... Oh, I'm sorry. So when something goes in your mouth, it's sexual? Come on. This is pretty cool. You can smoke weed while you do it. I feel like the hottest athletes for me would be female volleyball players. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <We're> back. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yes. Oh Thank my god. god. <laughs> Recording live back. from somewhere. GII Nation, we are back and blessing Dude. your ear holes, baby. Did you miss you're that? Saying, oh. You're saying ear holes again? Yeah, yeah. I'm saying ear holes again. I feel like again. ear holes were, no. that was real big back in the day when everyone was saying ear holes. Was that a Say 90s less. rap, 2000 aughts rap thing? All up in I, your ear holes. I think it was a 2010s bad comedy thing. <laughs> oh. Yeah! Okay, yeah. Like, okay. I okay. Like, uh, it's poisoning my ear holes or something. That you know sounds what I mean? very, yeah. yeah oh, like, wow. It seems like it'd be on the on our whiteboard. Yeah. My well, reference Judd, is uh, Q-Tip on... Um, okay. Uh, not Midnight Marauders. <laughs> so do. See, something but that's the your, thing with... Something for your ear holes so you can clean them shits out, I believe oh. is the line on okay. Beats, Rhymes, and Life somewhere in there. Okay. And I think that's the, how, how comedy works, Anders, is uh, just... Q-tip says, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Q-tip says something. Yeah, Q-tip says something, and then twenty years yeah. later, an entire generation of comedy writers steal yeah. that right. thing. Yeah. Right. So vibrant. yeah, is I do vi- think that what sitcom thing? was it where they kept being like, "Can I kick it?" And then, and then that was like the <laughs> <laughs> then they would they would exit stage left. That's kind of sick. I want to see that. Yeah. What sitcom was saying, "Can I kick it?" A whole bunch. Mm. The make believe mm. one that Durst just made up. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Three and three and a third man. Damn, son, uh, dude. Fuck, dude. Are we this back? Good. Fuck. Yeah, man. Did you guys hear that, weird, dude? Three and a third man. We're back. <laughs> it's been a while, dude. It's been. I know. Uh, wild. How many? It feels on like fire. a year, but it, it's only been two weeks. We went two weeks. Yeah. Without, you know, people were traveling, things were happening. Yeah. You know, I don't want to get into the weeds with it, but things no. things happened, you know? You know and that's a cool way to describe do, it. Things happened. <laughs> <laughs> things yes, happened. Yeah. If you want to talk about things happening, Durs, feel free. Hey, but time time marches on, as he would say. Dude, as much. Yeah. Um, says. but we're back. We're back. We're doing a big, like a giant fucked a giant bitch and had a giant kid. Hey. We're back. We're doing it. Perfect. Uh, did any, uh, a crazy thing happened to me the other day, dude. Wait a minute. Okay. Mm-hmm. Please get this it is, off your chest and put it in my ear holes. This is Adam. Yeah. Dunk the crazy it thing in my ear holes. Uh, dude, I, oh, it's my, <laughs> my, <laughs> My you you didn't muted. shit a string out? What's happened? Okay. I didn't shit a string. I wish wow, it was like that. Dude. But uh, that's crazy. So my doctor said that they thought Uh-oh. I had stiff person again. Did oh, I, tell you I remember this? you mentioning that. Yeah. 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 No it's follow up. Back. No follow up texts about it. Thank it's you for back. That, but yeah. but uh, yeah. So I then once again stiff person mm-hmm. syndrome. For oh, those right. that didn't listen about thirty episodes ago, uh, yeah. it's it's where you crumple up and die. Uh, Celine Dion has it. Like the mm-hmm. life expectancy. From what I've read on the internet, mm-hmm. with my uh, m- my little doctor sleuthing, mm-hmm. it says six months. Or, sorry, science. six years. Oh, of the man. average life is <laughs> okay. Well, it's six yeah. And, yeah okay. Sorry, right. six decades. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> six lifetimes. Okay. No, six years. So mm-hmm. uh, that you know. So it was really scary. And then so they go, well, you have to go see. We think it's stiff person syndrome. So you have to go see the <laughs> stiff person syndrome what a bit. guy yeah. in Philadelphia. So I go there alone. Oh, so that's why you were in Philly. Oh, that. I, was I thought you Philly. were just going yeah. to see like Shane Gillis live or something. Holy I shit. I wasn't going to go see the... Shane Gillis live. No, I wasn't. Okay. Okay. I, did I thought see you were going to go see Boys to Men live. But I didn't see the, him do stand up live. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, Fair enough. So. I was at the, so I went to see Mr. Stiff Person Syndrome, sorry, doctor, and he mm-hmm. was so old, dude. It was awesome. This is what you want in a doctor. You know right. what I mean? Okay. Like the eyebrow hairs were connecting. Oh, they were so shit. long. Yeah. Oh, um, were they coming out the Wisdom. side too? Like, um, yeah. like dude, uh, they were Morgan flying Freeman away. And I have a few, movie? I have a few, you know, dogs that wiggle and waggle. 
in yeah, my yeah, eyebrow yeah. here. You got some. Long you know, ones. who does? I got a. I got a couple. I know Deers does. Deers yeah, has. Deers has. has a, yeah. Straight oh, yeah. up. No, oh no my god. Eyebrow. <laughs> yeah. going. We, He's we about to look like a serial killer. I think I got the shades on. So this doctor. Dude, I was the last person in the office. I think they were like doing me a favor, being like, he's an actor. We're going to bring in him last. So, mm-hmm. But it made it way more ominous and scary. Okay. Sure. <laughs> so I go there. I think I'm dying, right? As I have been for the last like two months. Perfect. I hear just his footsteps come clicking and clacking down the hall. Is he wearing high heels? What's he got well, on feet? Some, some doctor, some like dressy Broken doctor stocks. shoes, you know. Yeah. And, like and uh, Turns out I don't have stiff person syndrome. Again, okay, okay. Yeah, so okay. Hold it, was, on. it was a big, big deal. But That's according, uh, to, according to this guy, according to yeah, this guy, yeah, who is the doctor yeah. that, like, I think he coined the phrase stiff person syndrome. He wrote a lot of the materials. Did you give him shit about that? Where you're like, yeah. this is the name. That's it. Well, I, I should have. I was mostly thinking about my, the life and death situation. I was, I was right, right, right. But right. yeah, I was years, I, though. What, what was crazy about it? My wife had all these follow up questions. Well, like, what do you then have? I answered. So wait, I he's not going to die, Fuck. <laughs> dude. I asked zero other I know. questions. She's I was like, just dude, so. Is there thrilled. any way he's going to die? Is there anything you're seeing on in the horizon that might <laughs> right. take Adam out that's, real quick? That's what Chloe's asking. <laughs> yeah. So what yeah. are you going to die from? Like, and it will right. be, will it be quick? And, and, and how much assume. life insurance did you take out? Yeah. Right. What's going on here? Be what's going on? Uh, Wait, so is yes. that the relationship that we just have men with women? Let's, let's break it down. Nineties. Oh, kind of, yes. okay. <laughs> style. Like All right. Don't like, don't like it. it. Durs, come on, break us up. I'm the same way though. Where like I go and I have like a meeting or a something and this I bitch. don't ask questions. <laughs> and then when I get home, my wife is always like, <laughs> oh. she asks me like, so what about this, that? And I'm like, I didn't ask. She's like, okay, but so then when is the thing? And I go, I didn't ask I- that either. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know. No, that's for sure. I, I just did a back to school. I just don't want to know. <laughs> yeah. I just did okay, a back go. to school night. The teacher was like rattling a bunch of shit off. She was like not good at her job. She asked if there's any questions. I was well, just like, I'm so probably a fan. I wouldn't do that. Luckily, I went with Sam. So she like asked, like, so are they going to like, are you going to test the kids and all this shit? Because I think the Great teacher question. was. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> nice, Sam. She was pretty nervous, nervous. So she didn't give Nerf- a lot of info. So Wait. the teacher was nervous. I don't know if that's so what we're talking like, about. You're talking about people who aren't <laughs> offering information. I'm talking about men, classically. Yeah, that was not exa- trained at all not to what ask we were talking about, Dirk. Donkey! Yeah. Blake, th- that, that's not <laughs> I at just wanted to be part of the conversation. As you know, <laughs> as a bitch, I don't really It helps to listen. You, you told, you told a yeah. story that in no relation to what we were talking about even a little yeah, bit you were like yeah and then i met this teacher who sucked at her job right i just want to be a part of this this man circle bro you ever Come you ever on. go to panda express and uh, they just don't have any orange chicken what's with that Dang, man that, that's enough to get me freaking pissed off i'll jump over the counter on those people yeah so okay. it uh yeah i'd say that it was a th- that's a, a a common male trait i uh <laughs> And do we yeah, not but, ask questions because we're just are like, and you, you think I would ask like all the first or what? Is this because one like w- when you're like lost and then like you don't want to ask for directions? Is that yeah, a maybe? Thing? Yeah, is that a man thing? But I I don't mind asking questions when I'm lost. I'm my Emma Emma's like we'll figure it out, and she's like doing but, the map, but when and are not you, just typing it in? Yeah, when are right. we? When are we lost now? There's no this, getting lost. I, I did, this I'm is like a, a fake, so, fake, silly question. Uh, no, no, no. But but no, sometimes you'll enter like something stuff, in, right? Like we'll just get lost sometimes. Like no, that's a you. That's, that's a like you a, stuff. Blake, 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 Blake likes just to wing gets it. Lost, dude. I, I feel like that. That's kind of a man thing. I feel like I'm a, what I'm is amongst some men like getting lost, and then we don't ask directions, do we? Do we? I had to beat into you have a my wife sound uh, <laughs> using maps. She would never like just enter it in and then hit go and like let it give directions. She would like zoom around and like to try sort to find a herself. better route herself. Mm. I don't know mm. if it's to find a better route or to just work her brain or what. But she'd like, yeah, you're gonna turn up here. Oh, oh that's dude. that. And then and I'm like, can you just and hit I know it you guys have been together and for put so it in long, the dash. But that's. 
that's grounds for a divorce. Oh that's, shit! That, yeah, that's oh, yeah. what Thank does you. it. Thank that's, you. That's <laughs> yes, that, yes, that yes. to me. No. I would I would cash in the whole. I would blow up that's my it. entire life. I've been cl- yeah. I've been t- I've been texting been with close. Chloe about <laughs> yeah. um, just like finding diseases and any possibility. <laughs> <laughs> you know. Now. A- Emma's got a bunion, and I'm like, maybe those can be fatal. I don't know. Yeah, I'm like what's possibly. going on here? Mm-hmm. Damn, bunion infection. That'd be crazy. I don't know if bunions are infections, but I'll figure it out. What is oh, a bunion? Done. I've actually never had a bunion in my life. What is a bunion? Is it the same as a corn? You had a cinnamon? <laughs> Damn, for days. Let's just bro. say when things get freaky in the bedroom, yes, I like to have me a I like to have me a cinnamon. What is, um, is it the same as a corn? Do you remember when like they would talk about corns on like sitcoms all the time? I'm yes. mainly thinking ja- about Martin. I think. I think Jamie Foxx did a whole hour about corns. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, I don't remember a lot of corn material coming. A lot, the, dude, the there were a lot of corns. There were a lot corn, of corn corns on well, feet. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, I think a cor- corn is like just corns. a callus, right? It's just yeah. when somebody has a callus, right? But a bunion is when your toe, your big toe, starts going like. Uh, out like towards your other toes because what of like the, hell? the shape of your shoes or if you put a lot of like pressure like emma's a marathon oh so like oh so like a lot of women have it from wearing she's heels, got those alligator kind of, feet or you know dance shoes or whatever yes right? okay. exactly yeah. yes yes okay. like i think ballerina's feet are just bunion central Jeez. so is that why some guys have like foot fetishes because they're like uh okay. they're like oh the perfect foot women yeah. normally have such gnarled disgusting feet <laughs> <laughs> that uh, if you Somebody find one that me. doesn't have those things, you're like, that's a grand prize. I don't know. I think so. Why do I think guys so. have foot fetishes? I think I don't it's know because, because that's like, specifically they had a big a guy sister thing. who used to just put their fucking feet in their mouth when they were babies, and they're like, I'm oh. a foot person. Ugh. Yeah, Ugh. I don't know. I, don't know. I saw Ugh. like a gnarly video on the internet where like uh, this dude was like stopped at a red light and he's like filming a truck right by him and this dude is just deep throating his girl's foot at the red light just like yeah that's a red light like, special oh i right. think i saw that too and that's on this like 750th page of Pornhub. <laughs> yeah it's, right. uh, yeah, right. it's, it's this towards went the to back the depths. it's towards the back a little bit yeah yeah <laughs> No, on, on Pornhub, that'd be right towards the front. Yeah, I baby. do kind of like to do that on Pornhub, where you just go to the last page. Yeah, first. Oh, you just you. Oh, okay. You oh, search wow. from the back. You hit it from the back. I and like, you could. I like a reach around. You can do that. I think you can so. go to maybe the very last page. Maybe it's not Pornhub. Maybe it's like um, I don't know, like a chat. This guy's looking at another site. This guy's. What indeed. do they call the, um, the the cam the cam ones where you just go to like oh, the person who's got like. One oh, person God. watching them. Very shagadelic. And you're like, this is an oh, intimate situation. You want to be the only know. person watching? <laughs> so they're no, like, I'm just saying, you go, you go with, because it's crazy. I don't know so, if you go uh, on these hey, sites. Uh, what's yeah. up? Well, like, well, Thirty thousand say... people are watching this girl <laughs> like sing. What's so, up, uh, Funny Man eighty <laughs> two? It's just me and you in here. How's it going, brother? <laughs> you tried to think of Durs's age, dude. He's way older than eighty two. Uh, <laughs> Funny yeah. man, seventy eight. Yeah, born in eighty. <laughs> anyway. Hot, 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 hot. Um, yeah, I was thinking the year. Come on. But no, the back page. I think the back page is uncharted territory. <laughs> I agree. Well, I, I do like that about you, Durs. Yeah, because you're mm-hmm. you're you're looking outside the box. I'm digging in the crates. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. You know, That's cool. we're digging um, in the crates. I, of, not everybody uh, likes Taylor Swift. Some people want to listen to. Uh, um, there's Taylor not Taylor not so here. swift. Yeah, there we go. There had to be another. <laughs> there had to be something Very else. Shagadana. Hey guys, um, guess uh, what? <laughs> I feel like I feel like at the the last page of Pornhub, yeah. they're not even having sex anymore. It's yeah, like looped yeah. back around. You right. know what I mean? They're just it's just a family eating dinner and everyone's kind of getting along. And that right. is what some people really get off to is just a yeah, nice right. family just dinner. Just the, the ultimate kink is just a nice family dinner where yeah. everybody's Ask passing the mashed day. potatoes. Yeah, so and yeah. it's not sexual when they pass them. Not at yeah. all. Uh-uh. It's down to business. Mm-hmm. In it's downright literally world. just down to business of eating. Is that what you meant? Y- yes, yeah. exactly. Okay. Like, yeah. Pass the potato, put it on the plate, 
Mm-hmm. Right to yep, smother it in butter, stick it in my mouth. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yep. Not, not in a sexual way. Not in a sexual way. Not in a sexual way. Oh, I'm sorry. So when something goes in your mouth, it's sexual? Come on. Is this so is this sexual for you? That's not a sexual way. <laughs> no, That's just a man deep water. throat in a water bottle. To, yeah, and now, water. if you're listening, you wouldn't have heard that. But if you're one of our 100,000 YouTube Which, subscribers, yeah, you saw me deep throat We have a bit of announcement, everybody. <laughs> we have reached the pinnacle. We have officially hit okay. 100,000. You graduated? I thought that was going to be the United Airlines song for a second. And I was like, we're flying. We're um, what? And what sucks about the 100,000 subscribers is we mm-hmm. find, we we barely got there. We, yeah, we, we, we were stumbling we over the finish line. Yeah. Right. Uh, that's not even that good. You know <laughs> what I mean? Our numbers are still wildly low. Mm-hmm. And I'm not going to until we hit 10 million. Okay? Yes. No, you are right. Because okay. as as we were like begging begging our <laughs> to subscribe <laughs> to YouTube. I feel like you you were begging yeah go ahead oh I was yeah. posting to yeah. my story constantly it was just, oh yeah I I, yeah. I want that plaque so bad the yeah. day Blake that I, was posting more about the plaque than when we were on tour trying to get people to come out and see us he was definitely drunk. post he was well, posting he more was, about the plaque he than was drunk yeah 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 absolutely, okay yeah. absolutely yeah. but yeah, with that said, drunk drunk for three months yeah that that same day uh, Ronaldo, the football player, he started a YouTube mm-hmm. channel, and in one day he got yep. 50 million subscribers, mm-hmm. and he got the plaque. So you're telling me that this podcast yeah. isn't as important, important, or <laughs> famous as <laughs> Ronaldo, <laughs> the soccer player? <laughs> I, just, I can't believe that. Yeah, that's in my heart of hearts. And who's it's weird even to me that TII soccer. Nation isn't larger than some soccer player. Yeah. With exactly. admittedly a very cool name. Ronaldo yeah. is a very dope name. It's really cool. cool. Yeah. yeah. I'm more cool of a name. Ronaldinho. Oh uh, yeah, guy. that dude was sick. He had the long hair. Because you think it's kind of... Ronaldo, but it's not. Wait, that's yeah. not. I thought you were just putting some stank on Ronaldo's name. No, no there's Ronaldinho another guy. Was, I think he played for Brazilian. Brazil. And he, he had, had the long hair. He kind of he kind of had a, a messed up grill too. He had a look. Call. He yeah, had a look. look. It was a, a, a little look. critter, little critters but, too. The new batch type situation. Yeah, but footwork. Yeah, mad footwork. But Ronaldo is like very hot. He's very hot to me, at least. I think he's a handsome guy. All right, and this I'm gonna another... let that one dangle <laughs> okay. there. Yeah, Do you guys ever see the, about uh... how cool his name was? And I was like, yeah. yeah, that'd be fun if like you named your kid Ronaldo. Like, you know, people would think maybe you're a big soccer fan. Like, I'm not a yeah. big soccer fan, but maybe I might name my next son Ronaldo. Ronaldo, it is a dope Ronaldinho. Name. Ronaldinho. Uh, speaking of uh, handsome, you immediately Ronaldo. were just like, I want to fuck handsome. this dude. <laughs> well, yeah, I think that most. Football players are are pretty pretty hot. I think they might be the hottest athlete. Do you concur? Do you agree? I mean, I don't know. know. <laughs> Greco Roman wrestling body type. Allegedly, me, but, mm, I feel like the uh, hottest athletes for me would be female volleyball players. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's, that's that's an angle. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, sure. that's a take. <laughs> sure. I guess if you're a front page of Pornhub guy, but yeah. some of us go to page 759 to find our our hot shit. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah I, I mean, I guess yeah. I see where you're coming yeah. from in, to, in like yeah. a kind of normal yeah, like, like yeah. 90s way, but in 2024, okay. yeah, like, it just, like, it's a yeah, whole girls nice butts bikinis yeah like yeah, yeah right they, they've got like it they got it going on in like mm. a super obvious sure yeah that way yeah, i don't know um yeah, but in more of like a titil- kind of in more like a titillating homosexual way i yeah. think but blake likes <laughs> male <laughs> <soccer players. laughs> yeah 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 um, loose butthole yeah well for sure you know yeah. to each his own and we don't okay <laughs> and hey, this doesn't leave this podcast, okay? I I Just think that it. soccer players, um, they seem like the the more the most normal, like Thank athletes, you. like their body types. They're just kind of like lean, mm-hmm. wayfish, the wayfish <laughs> boys. Uh, well, no, I which think I they're guess they're all into. very like, very very in shape. Yes, yeah, they're but I they're like they're, they're, not they're, buff. they're fit, they're, they're fit, they're fit, they're mm. lean. 
Mm-hmm. They're not mm-hmm. like the way you uh-huh. say lean oh. is also kind of sexual too. Yeah, I'm kind have of you noticed that to... when Dur says lean, <laughs> yeah, like chill. he leans, he leans into it a <laughs> little too much. In. He leans oh. into the lean. Let's just uh, okay. <laughs> so you like the soccer players? You like keep, that lean? Keep look. giving no, it. I'm to just, my re- I'm just remarking. I'm just remarking that there's no like over, there's no overt <sighs> development of certain okay. muscles. Yeah. Like yeah. a male gymnast, those a male, gym- a male gymnast <laughs> arms. <laughs> And, oh. uh, yeah. and yeah, and yucky. like the, yeah, the muscularness of the taint, yeah, tight when he bought the hole. Yeah, uh, when we're the t- they got a lean, the lean taint. I'm I, like when the well, bros what about are like a the baseball rings? player. I feel like there's a lot of baseball players that that look more like they, regular guys than no, no they have really baseball players are asses. Soccer players. They have huge no, 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 no. asses. Their asses huge are asses. so big. Yeah, yes, their they asses are. And, are and they are they're jacked. Unlike you never noticed that. Well, I mean, some of them, like the guys that mm-hmm. crush home runs, those guys are. But there's some guys. Who, who, who do you who do you think looks normal? And I promise you, when you stand next their to them, and they, and they pull their <laughs> pants down slowly, they're out of this, Fuck it. They're a whole well, I know they another level. Like, but I'm going to come. Yeah, I mean, maybe you're right. Because I, I could see Blake's body being, if you told me that he was a professional soccer player. Okay. Thank you. Like a decade, two decades ago. I, I was going to say, <laughs> OG like Blake. Now, ago. Blake's got <laughs> muscle on muscle pizza, now. Pizza. Yeah. No, I wasn't Rash. necessarily talking about the muscle. I'm just like, what just you... the way his body's looking now. It's just aging. Just looks body built by Jägermeister a, l- a little bit. Yeah, a little okay. Bit. Yeah, I'm getting some Damn, muffin top. Damn, son. <laughs> I'm getting some muffin top. You're right. <laughs> just way, way to back out it. of that so quickly. It's, it's I expected hard. you to put up a fight a little bit. No, it's bit. hard. When a you hit bit. 40, it's hard to, yeah. it's hard to take well, the muffins off. The muffins, mm-hmm. they linger. They well, and I, I assume man. soccer's the type that you you don't get to play until you're 40. Like Blake would be a true phenom if he played until he was 40. Yeah, I don't like know how old is Ronaldo? Right. If you told me that's he was right. 22 years old, I'd be like, yeah, and he's ready to mm-hmm. retire. Well, that's the other thing about soccer is that like you can play at like 14 years old. Remember uh, Freddie Adu when we were little mm-hmm. kids? Like yeah, he yeah, was coming yeah. up going pro at 14, and it was like, oh shit. I could be a soccer who, who player. Who was the right young now. stud? There was a young stud in the Olympics for somebody. Um, yeah, this the dude who used oh, to yeah. play on Messi's team. I think he's on um the Gal LA Galaxy. He and he has, was like, like 16, huh? Yeah, he's fucking sick. So sick. And he was like scoring goals. He wasn't just yeah. like riding the bench, like put I me in coach. He was out there. Yeah, he's sick. You guys yeah. know And by the way, for sure lean. Hot. Yeah. Lean. Hot as fuck. Yeah. You guys know infinitely <laughs> more about soccer than I would have given you credit for. You don't tune in at all. Not have even, ever, not even a little bit. I don't think I've ever watched a game. Have you soccer. ever been to a game? Besides, like my yeah. friends at high school, when I was literally just waiting for them to be done so I could smoke weed with them. Right. You know? Yeah, that's right, 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 right. yeah, that's cool. Adam but was doing because... hacky sack, and he's like, basically the same thing under the bleachers. Yes. <laughs> that's yeah, exactly sh- right. Come kick this ball, guys. This is pretty <clears throat> yeah. cool. You can smoke weed you while can. you do it. No, I um, think it's because you're not you're not in LA too much. You got to go to like a LAFC game or Galaxy mm, game. FC games mm. are really fun, and they smoke a lot of weed in the crowd. They have like let's just say we're of- Angel City uh, uh, season ticket holders in my house. Okay, Get is it. that right? Hell Man, yeah! What is Angel City? What are these words that you guys? The are women's pro soccer. Emma got season tickets last year. <laughs> oh, okay. And dude. And is, is that and, see, and now and if you were dude, to say they got absolutely women trash. soccer players are the sexiest? I'd be I could no, no, like no, no, look no, at no. that. But no. the guy you are saying about you think the guys are the sexiest. Dude, I, yes. here's what I will say. Absolutely. We talk about how the guys are lean Fair. and like kind of wafy, right? Because mm-hmm. they're just running mm-hmm. their asses yeah. off. Mm-hmm. The pro the pro off. the pro women. It's a different body type. They are. It's not a different lean. wave. They mm. are no, no, no. They're not even waves. They're, well, because they're women, jacked. I think, can jacked. for the most part get wavy. <laughs> what you know what I mean? I, I feel like it's harder for men Wait, to be as wavy. Wa- Wait, well, what is? Wavy I feel like exactly? you in high school were wavy. Me? Yeah. What does that mean? No l- l- so, lack of muscle. Lack definition? of any muscle definition. Just like a, so a tiny I'm little. Confused. Percent. Who's it harder to get wafy for? Who's it's harder wafy? for men to get wafy. Thin, interesting, wafish. Interesting, interesting. Yeah. yeah, yeah. But what I'm saying is think? that... Yeah, yeah, exactly. But what I'm saying is that soccer player men are kind of thinner, lean, beautiful, mm. wavy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> whereas, whereas the female soccer Correct. players are jacked. Like, they're mm. way more muscular okay. than mm. 
the male counterparts for mm. their sport. Uh. Uh, like, what's her name? What's her name? There's someone who's like a, uh, she was like a G for a long time. And she's one of the co-owners of Angel City. And I saw her at a game, stood next to her. She was like six feet, maybe mm. six one, uh, and Abby Wambach. Dude. Oh, sure. Yeah. She was yeah. fucking jacked. Massive. Yeah, I, I was like I standing next to her kind of like being... sizing up. A, a mm. big, big girl, right? She was like, and, a, a and I guess my point would be, my yeah. point would be like, this is like having a six foot five, two twenty type dude playing soccer, which you just, you don't have, because that guy's mm. gonna go play football, right? Mm. Right. I see what you're saying. Yeah. Like football takes, football steals a lot of, and basketball steals a lot of athletes away from soccer. You know. Sure. What well, I, mean? I kind of think be like, like, cause our women's soccer absolutely rocks. Is our They're and our men's good. soccer is not anywhere near the same caliber, correct? No, no, because the world no, has so, just been so playing the, soccer. So you kind of want to get the season mm -hmm. tickets for the women in LA because mm -hmm. they're probably oh, yeah, a little stars, better, dude. right? Mm -hmm. And oh, there's yeah. dude, there's, a, there's a 16 year old and a 17 or 18 year old pair of sisters who are like in high school that are yeah, on this cool. pro team, which is just more g shit. And you're like, sisters, that's crazy. Like, what is dinner like at that wow. household? Like, yeah. what are mom and dad sister. doing that is setting these girls up to be just absolutely? My juice. guess is like a lot of carbs at dinner. Yeah, probably. But dude, just what is the, what is know, the mental what is the conversation? Are they just talking they about this talk. podcast, you think? <laughs> they don't <laughs> they talk. Just, they probably just put it's, on TII. And it's just, a mixture yeah. of listening to this podcast and not talking. <laughs> and not for talking. Sure. Well, because they're yeah. concentrating <clears throat> on getting enough you know, macronutrients to fuel their sure. muscles so they can attack the Adam. field the next day. <laughs> Adam, please quote more YouTube videos you've been watching. What are macronutrients? What, what is a give macronutrient, me more. baby? Oh, you guys don't know macronutrients? Is that, a, is, that a, is, that a, is that a Happy Meal? <laughs> wow. You got, I mean... And yes, points! Yeah, <laughs> macronutrients. That's, so the chicken How many fitness nuggets? influencers do you guys follow? Is that a Mac Because rib? it seems like not enough, dude. <laughs> Mac rib, brother. Uh, not, macronutrients are Mac just Fury, the calories, fat, and protein. And Wait, sorry, carbohydrates. One, one more time. What did you just say? There was the people in the back. I believe it's fat, carbohydrates, and protein. Those are macronutrients. Mm -hmm. So, okay. like the ones that taste really good. <laughs> no. What, well, sure. What about, what about Velveeta Maybe. shells and cheese? Those, <laughs> those sound like all the things I like to eat, like bread and meat right right <laughs> uh, sure i yeah, like it's just it's just a breaking it down like what you've eaten so the okay. macronutrients of anything so it could be of a piece of pizza or it can be of i don't even steak know what or what uh, you lost me you lost uh, me yeah. bro yeah it's science okay i don't even know that you guys are so dumb dude I know. I, feel like I, you're I, also I guess I do. You, do you understand I feel what he's like saying? You're also reading. I'm not it. reading it. I'm not reading it. I mean, if I was reading it, I'd give you a, an actual. I mean, do you want me to look up the actual definition? I hope I'm right. <laughs> How big is your screen that you're looking at? That's why I think you're playing because you're like looking over here. I think you're reading it right in front of me. <laughs> this dude's got the Vision Pro. Macronutrients are nutrients that the body needs in large amounts to provide energy and maintain its structure and systems. The three got main it. macronutrients mm. are carbohydrates, fats, and protein. Mm. Okay, it's so science. what you're saying is these are the th these are the three food groups that you need the most of out of anything groups they're the the macronutrients so a food like a fat oh here we go i guess like what i'm a saying piece is of bread has fat in it okay it also has i'm not saying i'm not saying i'm not saying food groups as in like uh breads vegetables meats or whatever i'm saying like food groups in that like sugars are not a macronutrient i, I mean i don't believe so I, right. I just know the three <laughs> th three main. Maybe it goes way down in the in the crates, and and it is sugars too. So but Blake, when you're when you're watching according, a soccer according game, to are the, the players a macronutrient for you? Absolutely, freaking loopy, baby. <laughs> according to the fitness influencers that I follow, those are the three main. You know, that's, <clears throat> oh, okay. that's, who yeah. who do you follow? Yeah. Jumu Fuku and um. I yeah, I follow him. Uh, dude, I follow a lot, dude. I don't actually I don't, quite a quite a few. How about do you follow the guy who we had on Workaholics who you flexed off with, who's now having a moment oh. where like it's just videos of him walking? Oh, like uh, Michael Hearn. Now, I, yeah, 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 I, yeah, yeah. I do follow him. 
he works out with Tony Cavallero like all the time. Oh my god! Yeah, they're like yeah. homies well, Tony's, who, wor- Tony's who work out buff. together. Tony, oh, I've been working out with him. He's part of the reason I've gotten in great shape this season. Is I literally yeah. am working out with him, and he, I mean, his workouts are infinitely harder than the workouts that I do. And I do. Hard is he workouts, a maniac? Or so is he I a maniac? Think. I an absolute yeah. psychopath, and I'm excited for people to see him in mm-hmm. this season of the Righteous Gemstones because he is absolutely shredded in a way that he's never been before. Does Damn. he eat or does he eat or drink? He uh, and by that I mean like does he eat like normal he, or does and does he drink he, alcohol? He does no, not drink sober. alcohol. He's a sober guy. Oh, and so that's cheating. He, that's cheating. Yeah. So, Thank okay. you, God. Don't well, that, that's why I've also gotten in, in decent shape this year is because I basically stopped drinking. Like, I might wow. drink once a month. Yeah. <laughs> wow, yeah, dude. dude. It sucks. Flash. Holy shit. It sucks. Um, it does. It sucks. I'm not crying underneath <laughs> the shade. Yeah. We lost one. Yeah, I know. It really <laughs> sucks. One. Believe me, I don't want to. I don't want to. I just, yeah. uh, my body is falling apart. So, yeah. Um, you know. Gone. Yeah, it sucks. But I was I was real. Salty I, I think you've got boring person syndrome, <laughs> <laughs> dude. I know. <laughs> Believe me, I know. And I, I still yes, will boys. have a, a drink or two if we're at dinner or whatever. But I've got but stiff just... drinks. <laughs> I've got stiff drink syndrome. <laughs> yes, points. Oh man, can't stop. Won't we're stop. Back. Should stop. Should probably stop. Um. So wait. Uh. Shit, I forgot what the fuck I was going to say. Damn it. It was about the drink thing. About oh, bodies, yeah, dude, so drinking. When you do have one or two drinks, does it just lean it soccer really players. Fu- it really fucks you up? <laughs> no, I'm done talking about soccer players for now. Like, uh, I, it, yeah, it'll make my spasms more spasmy, which then yeah, causes yeah. my muscles to mm-hmm. tighten more and then my mm-hmm. next week to be shittier. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. So, so has I, pick, anyone, I, I really has, pick my spots, but so that's what? also why I, ha- I have a vague outline of abs now. Which is Hello. really tight. Like a cool thing. Oh, if you're sick. gonna have an autoimmune disease, you want to have like a vague outline of abs, where you're yeah. sort of yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah, no, I could see him. Hell yeah, yeah I do. But I do have a little bit. Have of you the seen Adam's body? Thing. He's dying. Yeah, he's. <laughs> yeah. I think he might be dying. That's hot. Yeah. It's so hot. It'll yeah. hot right now. I, I have the fat guy droop a little bit though, because I because mm. I basically I lost like 25 pounds. So yeah, that's right. I don't I've never had that big of a swing before, and it's 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 hanging a little bit. Oh, okay. You know? Are we talking about just like loose skin? Loose. A little, a little bit. It's not too crazy. It's not like I lost like 80 pounds or whatever, but it's just enough yeah. to go like, hey, hmm. you're 40 I now. Saw, We're not going to snap too as quick. I saw the kid from um, not Zach and Cody, w- one of those shows who like grew up and he got hot. He was fat on like a Nickelodeon show. Oh, and uh, like, Drake, uh, and Josh. Drake, Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. Yeah. Drake and Josh. I saw Drake him Josh. talking Drake about Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. Drake and Josh. How he lost all the weight, but he's still got kind of like a skin situation, which seems like a real bummer. But yeah, like, that would be a real bummer. This isn't this isn't that, you know. Isn't is, you is, isn't it though? It's the beginning of that. I feel like if I try if I <laughs> was twenty pounds heavier and I lost like yeah. forty five or fifty pounds, then yeah. then yeah. But can't you I think get you all can that just do like, vitamin E or something like that and it like helps that your skin? Oh, okay. I, I think it, I e think it's it? vitamin E that like helps your skin snap back. Holy shit! Well, not if yeah, it's this too is much important. skin. Then <laughs> not if it's really too much is. skin. Yeah, that it has to be a surgery if it's too much skin. What is, at a certain oh, point, yeah, 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 yeah. At a certain point, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah How yeah, do yeah, they yeah, do yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. Do they like pull your skin back on your back and then like staple it and then like snip off the excess or something? What is that surgery even like? Yeah. Are you asking us? Well, how, yeah. well, how do you think we would know how that surgery is? I, I imagine think that's what it you is. went down. If you were having some droopy skin, maybe you click the YouTube or you follow us. I, I bet doctor. they don't pull it to the side. I bet they pull it down and then they do like uh, a scar like at your belly below your pant line. So like you can yeah. walk I'm around assuming. without like a scar on your sides. I love it. Uh, and, and then your nipples end up like midway. Oh, your nipples are way down by your belly. And button. your belly That's button, you don't they got they got to make you like a new belly button. I'm guessing. Yes, it's a Jackson Pollock painting. <laughs> is your chest after okay. they're after they're done with you? That's true. Uh, is it Jackson Pollock or is, uh, Dali? Where it's Dali like, is who I was thinking of. You're right, Droopy, <laughs> the Droopy. Yeah, I, I was like it. Salvador. It's flattered paint. Okay. <laughs> Which, by the way, I just I don't know where I, I saw a photo of Salvador Dali. Mm-hmm. He was like alive not that long ago. I know it's crazy. I yeah. thought he was like a super old timey, like same. Michelangelo yeah, and Salvador Dali were kicking yeah. it. 
during yeah. the Renaissance doing I, the paintings. No. I also found it very confusing that he was alive very recently. I thought he was kind of like... Was he successful, Salvador Dali, in his time? Was he famous? I, I think yeah. so. I think, yeah. Didn't he like... Because his even, paintings... Like, he wasn't popular right after. I mean, like... Well, that's the how... It, it melt, usually, melting clocks. Of course. This is like they die, and then after they're dead, their work yes. catches on, and they become super famous. But yeah. I think Salvador... Yeah, he died in that's what That's what I'm banking on for me, too. So, yeah. yeah. We'll see. Don't tell that's, me. Like, Don't tell me. That's Wasn't when he... Workaholics is really going to take off. That's when <laughs> they're, they're going to find it. Uh -huh. yeah. Freaking see ya. Let's kill Kyle real quick. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Never. Yeah, didn't it, like Salvador that. Dali and like uh, Warhol kick it together? Like, I want to. I mean, say he died were... in '89. That's Adam. You're right. That is crazy. Like, he could have been on like yeah. talk shows we watched as kids. Oh yeah, that was something I saw. That it was like yeah. uh, Salvador Dali could have watched Predator One, the movie. Like, it's crazy to think that like those two <laughs> things existed at the same time. I gotta time. get on I mean, your algorithm. I'm on the wrong algorithm. Yeah, dude, that's Adam's got the macronutrients. Yes, that's exactly. <laughs> That's, That's exactly right. Yes. Like the he dude who seen was drawing. Rambo. <laughs> yeah. He could have he, seen Adventures in Babysitting, dude. Yeah. Yeah. That's fucking Which crazy. holds up. Just watched it a week ago. Holds up. Really? You just yeah. watched Adventures in Babysitting one week ago. This is showing the kids ad Adventures yeah, in got, Babysitting. Yeah. This is what you do. Because yeah. movies okay. used to be, movies used to be fucking awesome. And, and uh, do your children anymore. like, did they like that? Loved Adventures in Babysitting. Really? I'm having Thought trouble it was remembering. Hilarious. All I remember is they think the mechanic <clears throat> is Thor. I remember that. Yes. But and what dude, else the fuck the, is that movie about? I'm trying I'm blanking on his name now, but the guy who plays Thor, it's Kingpin from the Daredevil series recently and from oh. Full Metal Jacket and um uh, and not NCI. Yeah. Yeah. He's on like Long uh, Order or whatever. It's like it starts with a D, doesn't it? Or a Yeah, it does. There we go. What's what his, is it? Todd's got it. Did Coveney? No. Did it's that's so close. That's so it's, close. Adventures in Babysitting. Nga, nga, nga. Oh, dude, I bet some people are want to kick their Vincent D'Onofrio. Oh, and he, one of our which is best. insane. Wow. He is one of our best. Yes, but like blonde so hair, good. maybe a, probably a wig. I don't know. But like that's spelt crazy. lean, lean in this yeah. movie. Soccer this soccer player body. was lean in this movie. Is that what you're saying? I think. Yeah, I guess if he was playing Thor. Yeah. Yeah. Remember, they like go to the mechanic, and like the one kid thinks he's so Thor, wait, and then he's so like, Vincent D'Onofrio was yeah. the Thor character in the movie. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Isn't that that's crazy? Not, that's and, wild. I mean, this guy, he's got such a mean looking face. Does yeah. he not? Yeah. yeah. Yes, yes. Like, he, yes. there's, is there be the first a possibility he's a nice guy? I think with I, a face I, like I, that, you either have to be super nice or yeah, yeah, you just. But then I you're like say... you're super nice to the point that people are like kind of scared that you're like <laughs> yeah. keeping like there's like trap doors in your closet and shit. You know <laughs> what I mean? He, like, he, yeah, he looks like, like a guy you, who like doesn't suffer fools who you got to just keep up uh, with, or he's got no okay. time for you. Mm. Had, yeah, that suffering really, fools. That's yeah, a good like way to call someone an asshole without <laughs> yeah. with and kind of giving really? them a compliment. Well, he doesn't uh, yeah, suffer no, fools. He doesn't yeah, suffer fools. My my mother in law, she doesn't uh, suffer fools. So let's just that's, <laughs> and let's just put it that way. <laughs> let's, yeah. let's just leave it right the, there. Okay, it's just let's a just subtitle. Well, my mother, I don't like her. Mm -hmm. She um, doesn't really suffer, uh, suffer fools. fools. No, I want to say that saying. I watched an interview with him that made me really like him. I don't know okay. what the fuck it was, and this was I'm years ago. But, you know, a lot of actors who've been around forever that just like, aren't yeah, in the man, spotlight, I, who you don't get to, to the... see doing interviews constantly, right? Like, um, I got like enough interviews of Glenn Powell <laughs> for the, in the last two years that I need for a lifetime. Vincent D'Onofrio been working for 30, 40 years. Mm -hmm. Have seen two interviews with him, and I think I really liked yeah. this one. He gives no you offense, an interview. Glenn Powell, but we're good. <laughs> That's cool. We, we, we need to find that interview. I wonder what it was. We for. got it, it probably, dude. <laughs> it was probably when he was doing Daredevil or something. Yeah, that was probably I think it pretty, was. Big, pretty big push. Which is, by the way, one of the greatest performances I've ever seen. Him as him King Daredevil. Him? Yeah. Really? Okay. I don't, Wait, I don't so you know. Had, you never you saw that about? Se season what, what one of King Daredevil Pin? Marvel show on oh. Netflix. Yeah. He I plays Kingpin, who's like the bad guy. And dude, mm -hmm. he fucking... 
elevates the show in a way where you're like, oh, this isn't just like corny, cheesy. Comic yeah, and it shit. for this sure is, awesome. is bad besides that character, right? <laughs> no, 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 no. This is isn't the Ben Daredevil Affleck one. This isn't the Ben no, no, Affleck. No, 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 no. Okay. Ben Affleck played this Daredevil in a series. movie. I, it's because I've never even China. heard yeah. of this show. This is like a popular television show, Daredevil. It's a char- It's a Marvel character, Daredevil. I think you would actually really like the show. Yeah, it's Adam. pretty it's cool. Right up it, your has, alley. it has really? like a super dope, like no cut fight scene in this hallway where that's just unbelievable. Like, yeah, it's like some of the sickest fight choreography. In the yeah, and are like there six minutes. now is the, but in the middle of the movie or show rather is there like mm-hmm. five three to five. Uh, Dudes in cowboy hats and cowboy boots doing the one. <laughs> Here comes the three to the four to the five. Everybody yeah. get up on the there, dance floor. You know that Adam, uh, TikTok I ass- dance? I, I assume you can watch it with your phone out if you need to. Pal. Okay. Yeah. Because <laughs> yeah. if there's not dudes dancing, doing TikTok dances, yeah. I'm okay. kind of checking out. You okay. know what I mean? So if there is, then I'm then I'm sure I'd be really interested. Yeah. No. Um, watch while you're on your phone. It, it hits the same. It's okay. really dope. Okay. Every and time you look up, you'll see something cool. Back to Adventures of Babysitting real quick. We yes, watched please. it on Run one of the screen. apps, and they've dubbed over the, like, people saying the the homosexual derogatory term starting with an F. They've oh. dubbed over that. So uh. that you can see the mouth be like, but they're saying, like, sissy or something or, like... Okay. Uh, what Dude, you're being a you, square. Because, or because what is it rated? It was it rated on? like PG, and then they say the, the F word. Yeah, yeah a bunch. Was... They say it. They like in one moment <laughs> wow. they say it like four times. Whoa! What, did you watch it on Disney Plus or what did you watch it on? Uh, I think it was either HBO Max or Disney Plus. But don't worry, I like set it for my kids. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I'm. I yeah, you let him. So you know what he's actually yeah. used. To Otherwise, say they're not going to get the young. movie. <laughs> Yeah, that makes sense. Right, 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 right. Absolutely. Because um, I know that Disney Plus like goes back in and edits a lot of their stuff, but I didn't know. that. And HBO they do disclaimers. Do they do disclaimers. Yes. Like if you watch, we've talked about this, I think, Swiss Family Robinson. They're like, so they had real dogs fighting tigers. Just a heads yeah. up. Uh, yeah, hey, well, they, they depict Asian people as pirates. Uh, heads up. Um, up. Yeah, uh, they're. If you watch, which Apocalypse I thought was now, cool as a kid, I was like, I didn't know there were Asian pirates. I just thought it was a bunch of white guys out there, and I was like, dang, no, it's a, it's everybody, it's every, uh, it's black, white, polka dot, it's the whole nine yards. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like <laughs> old, old guys there. can't, <laughs> old guys can't say any more races than black, white. They go straight to polka dot before yeah. being like indigenous, Asian, Latin American. They're just like. Fucking stripe yes. zebra print. <laughs> the color it's, brown doesn't even exist in their vocabulary. So crazy. <laughs> Black, white, polka, polka dots. <laughs> like, like, who did they I think they care. were doing a service to? I don't care if you're black or white. Okay, cool. Or fucking neon green. Well, no one is that. <laughs> no one Can is that, sir. And you're like, are you not saying brown? <laughs> And it's by the yeah, way, it's like, I and think, then I what other they colors do are? It, they do care allowed. for brown. They do <laughs> like, care. Yeah, they, <laughs> yeah, exactly. you. yeah he what doesn't care brown? if they're black or say, white or. Did you hear or, what I said? Right, right. <laughs> Grandpa, what about brown? You heard my list, you heard, right? You heard my list. <laughs> but then, ironically, well, there's definitely neon like neon green, white, or there's neon green. There's a couple colors that you shouldn't you shouldn't say also anymore, which is interesting. I don't know. Hey, Say it's it. all fascinating. <laughs> I don't know the rules anymore. This but, uh, is fascinating. <laughs> this is fascinating. Any take backs? Uh, <laughs> wait, wait, they did, they so love we, Adventures in Babysitting. They love. They can, love. Can we get a rough plot summary, please? What is the damn uh, plot? Yeah. The plot is uh, a girl who doesn't want to babysit don't anymore. Don't she thinks she's too. She thinks she's too old to babysit. She wants to be a grown up. How now. She's old are you talking? Too old to babysit. I think she's 19. She might be in college. Okay. Okay. Maybe she's okay. a senior. Okay. She's either a senior in high school or a freshman in college, something like that. And she's okay. got a boyfriend played by Bradley Whit- Whitford. 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 <laughs> yeah. who, who crushes as, I, as always. <laughs> because any, does he play a dickhead? <laughs> always, yes. So yeah, good. He plays 80s such a good dickhead. dickhead like, hats Thank off. you, God. And I forget who told me he's actually a great guy. Someone told me that he's fantastic. 
I worked yeah. with him and he's awesome. And he was a fan okay. of Workaholics. Maybe, maybe he watched real. it with his kids. Oh, um, I love you guys. Yeah. And he's went to he's from Madison. He spoke at my wife's graduation. Total oh, G. Oh, hell yeah. I love um, that. Hey, and that's a great example of someone that looks like they would probably be a total prick. Yes. Mm-hmm. Ends up being a pretty great guy. Yeah. And by the way, so Adventures in Babysitting plays an asshole. Uh, Revenge of the Nerds 2 reinvents what we know as an asshole as like a nice guy, soft asshole, like behind your back asshole. Mm, a real whoa. pivot, a real turn in wow, asshole like, in cinema. Uh, mm-hmm. And then, of course, uh, uh, not Happy Gilmore. What's the other one? Billy, B- Madison. Billy Madison. Billy Madison. Billy, yep. Billy Madison. Yeah. Yes. Classic. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and so she wants to be a grown up. She takes the job babysitting, but then her friend calls who runs mm-hmm. away and is stuck at the like train station or some shit. And she's like, okay, kids, we got to go into the city from the burbs and go get my friend. Hilarity ensues. But why, okay. why does her friend need saving? Because she yeah. doesn't want to run away. She got oh, scared she got to cold run feet. away. Oh, she, she got, got cold, cold feet. feet. Marco. Um, mm. Who is also played by Penelope and Miller. Is that who it is? And she slays. Yeah. She steals okay, the show. Yes. There's yeah. a lot of funny All things. Right. My my kid's biggest funny takeaway, and this is so me of a thing, you guys will be like, yeah, okay, your, your kids when are you, going to be monsters. When you are done watching a movie, Durs, do you have like a little questionnaire for the children? Like, yeah, you what is your big no, funny takeaway? No. What is- uh, but uh, okay. I, guess, I guess I just ask if they liked it, you know what mm-hmm. I mean? Okay. Or okay. if you can mm-hmm. tell, whatever. But so there's a part where she's on the phone calling saying, like, I need to be saved. Like, you got to come get me. There's this person, that person. They're freaking me out. There's a guy who's just, like, standing there with a jacket on. And he opens it and just pulls out a gun and goes and points at the gun. It's like. (laughs) And my kids laughed so hard at that. And now it's their favorite thing to do is to, like, pretend to pull out a gun and go. (laughs) Um, And it just was it's such a weird, weird like break the fourth wall, not real thing that happens what? in the movie. That's, that's so bizarre. funny <laughs> that she's like, I don't want to be here. There's like a crazy homeless guy. And then just a dude who's showing a gun and laughing. <laughs> and your kids loved it. They yeah. loved it. They thought it was the All funniest right. thing ever. And it is. Well, I think we that's need to cool. tune in to adventures and babysitting. And this, this is why this podcast is so important is we it really is. We bring up movies from, Damn near forty years ago. Yeah, and but this is tell, a, and tell the world that they need to see him. It's important. But what's cool? What's Absolutely. cool about ba- Adventures of Babysitting is that, like, obviously, there's I don't know, if there's fewer movies back then, but like, there were iconic moments. And the f- scene on I don't fucking know the name of the building, but the diamond shaped roof building in where Chicago, like, icon of the there. skyline, where like the little Thor girl goes out on it. And the dude goes out after her to like get the Playboy or whatever because they're on the run because they they steal oh, this wow. Playboy that's got some like thing I don't remember like, any of this. They steal a Playboy, but that's this iconic. Is edgy stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The Jeez. pervert best friend steals a Playboy, and apparently there's Whoa. some like notes by a mafia like written in the Playboy oh. that they need back. That's yeah. right. That's dope. Yeah. Damn. And then there's I a girl see. in the Playboy that looks rated? exactly like her baby. Playboys. They're saying, <laughs> the, the, F they're word. saying the F word. <laughs> there's guns. That Dude, this is the 80s. It was, it was written. I think it was PG. You know? What wow. the hell? The 80s and there's great lines it. where she's like, don't fuck with the babysitter. That I think they also said, don't mess with the babysitter. What the hell? Yeah. PG-13. Oh, PG-13. PG-13. You're allowed PG-13. one F word. You're allowed one wow. F word That's in great. PG-13. But they've That's removed great. the F word. So now maybe it is PG. Not that F word, but the F E C K word. You're allowed one of those in the yeah, yeah, you yeah, could yeah, say yeah, fuck yeah. on the show, dude. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You don't you're right. You're yeah. right. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> you could just say that. Try- you're not I'm gonna actually, get canceled no, if you I, say I, fuck. I, I'm actually trying not to say it anymore. Oh, you were you yeah. gave up uh, drinking. I don't say the F word anymore, so yeah. please. Um mm. that I wouldn't F- say I gave F-E-C-K. up drinking. It uh it was taken from me, but yeah. Right. <laughs> That's your Liam Neeson movie. <laughs> yeah, take taken. Him. It was. It was when the doctor gave me the diagnosis. I have Adam, has, Adam has. Adam has a very <laughs> very <laughs> just taken. Set of skills. I Adam can, can beer. St- slug us. <laughs> Jesus, you're beating yeah, me to baby, it both I'm getting times. Kind of fast here. Get yes, yes points. I love it, baby. Yes, points. Oh. All right, um, we got any take backs? Any apologies? Any epic slams? Hmm. 
I'll give uh, a freaking big, we covered it a little bit, but I would love to give a big shout out to all of TII Nation that showed up to YouTube and smushed yeah. that subscribe Thanks button. We made it. Yes. Yeah. Um, we're hoping yeah. to have that plaque hanging up somewhere in somebody's room. We'll see. I wonder if they're, if YouTube is just kind of waiting in the wings, not sending that plaque out right away because they're like, mm -hmm. they're going to lose some followers. Right. <laughs> is that what they're thinking? Don't want to make because yeah, it's possible. Yeah, because it's, been, it it's been a couple weeks now, and uh, yeah. Yeah. we don't have a plaque. You know, so. Well, we and dropped I, a few best ofs, and I feel like yeah. people unsubscribe just to spite us. Just and to if spite you did us. that, we see you, and we, see we, we, we will and we, find you. Dude, we understand. <laughs> I get, we get it. it. We we don't like to put out best ofs, but sometimes right, life right, gets right. in the way, you know? Mm -hmm. yeah. That's a good way to put it. Good way to put it, Adam. That's life. And... And I don't, Todd, you're here. People are begging, people are clawing, people are screaming for us to upload YouTube the day the podcast drops. Mm. Can we get, can we, we get an answer as to why yeah. we can't that's, do that's that? That's why people say we don't have more subscribers. Uh, mm. It's because that we don't we drop would it have... the same day. We drop it right. like a couple days later. Right. Right, and I don't like right. to victim blame. I don't like to. And it victim might be on blame, us. Maybe, but... maybe we would then have to stockpile more episodes, which the fans don't. They, they come to us because of our topical takes. You our know what else I saw? Takes, like how mm -hmm. great Adventures in Babysitting is. <laughs> yes, which is huge. Mm -hmm. I saw some some podcasts that do, um, you know, YouTube. They have they're starting to do live YouTube recording. So you do the pod, but you can actually watch what you're about to listen to next week live, but then maybe your numbers drop off on the podcast. And, and do people pay extra video. for that? Is that like a Patreon situation? Uh, not that I know of. I think it's just like subscribe just to thing. know when it's happening. Because if you're not there, then you... you well, then it. I think the, uh, the cat would be out of the bag with how much editing is done to make us sound <laughs> slightly less retarded. Mm -hmm. And we got to keep like, that... Just, you know me, I like to keep cats in my <laughs> Like, because everyone's thinking, like, wow, they do. They already sound really fucking dumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah very yeah. dumb. And very dumb, just very uh, then I think if we were to do it live, they'd be like, oh, holy shit. One, one second here. As I say this, Adam, as you say the cat's out of the bag and I say, you know me, I like to keep a cat in a bag. So you do. You love what is this? What bags. is this saying that the we cat is out of the we bag? Put cats in bag? I'll tell so, you right now. I'll, I know what it is. Do you want to oh, guess? Because I have the real answer. Yeah. How do you have do the you real mind answer? If me and Adam, do you mind if me and Adam sign off? <laughs> yeah, please. please. <laughs> I think it was there was a, a type of whip called the cat a nine Wait. tails. <laughs> okay, so you think or you say you know? I, heard, I, I also picked up on this little yeah. uh, macro I uh, I nutrition. I think I know exactly you're, what it you're is. You're lollygagging. And you don't know. <laughs> you don't know what. Yeah. On a ship or something. And is like lollygagging that. the word of the week, Adam? <laughs> yeah, it is. Damn. Oh, damn. Oh, 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 we're got back. Him. Word of the day. And uh, you know that I know lollygagging, though. That's why I thought maybe I could throw it in. But it, it, yeah. I, I forgot at the beginning, yeah. and I, I didn't yeah. throw it in. Finish him. Try yeah, kind of, your tell, it, kind of your tell lately is that you just, it's the last <laughs> thing you say. <laughs> And it kind of works in the sentence, but also yeah. it's kind of a reach. Yeah, it's yeah. sort of a buzzer beater <laughs> yeah, word. Yeah. That's okay, exactly so any more right. lolly gags. So tell me the slam. cat of nine tails thing, you dork. Yeah, so no, it was about letting the cat out of the bag. The cat of nine tails. So that's what it is. That's the official. But was that answer. even kept in a bag? Yes, of course you keep your cat in the nine tails. And what do you just keep? It I on keep the mine on my ship. hip. Yeah, well, no, cat and I think they were. Let them know. Heavy. I think cat, mm. cat and nine tails were pretty heavy. I mm. gotta look them up. I'll check. Okay, them out. any take backs, apologies, <laughs> any epic slams? Okay, well, them. here Isaac has the phrase. It originates from livestock fraud at markets where animals were sold in sacks, mm. well, usually piglets. Doesn't... There's no way, oh, I Isaac. That doesn't... This sounds that like fan know. fiction. Yeah, yeah, I Punk feel like I'm Isaac radical. put this into, uh, you know. Chat GPT and it just sometimes yeah, it, it'd swap it a pig for a cat. Yeah. Oh. When the customer looked away, oh. ain't no way. Or would you swap a cat for the pig? Huh. What's more expensive, a pig or a cat? A pig. I There's way more meat on a pig. Mm. <laughs> <Are> you. 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I like my cats like I like my soccer players. Lean. Any take backs? Uh, any <laughs> poop any epic slams? Uh, well, no, I'm, I'm very happy and excited that we're back. It's good to be back yeah, here with TII Nation. Uh, and we're great. very sorry about the about the two weeks of best ofs. I hope some of you enjoyed them because, uh, to be perfectly honest, I do They're enjoy a best of. Yeah, when I fun. listen yeah. back to a best of, I'm like, it's, that's that's fun. All that's hitters. The best. Yeah, it's all hidden. You know, you, really they got good. the best of five apps. It's hidden. Yeah. It's a good app. Yeah. Yeah. And also, Enjoy it. this best of a uh, best of is 150 episodes ago. You know, mm. that's crazy. The man. fact that any of our fans can remember what happened, right? Uh, yeah, 150 I they were way episodes more ago. That's a good crazy. way to think of the best of is like a back page Pornhub mm. compilation you stumble upon, true. where you're like, it's all the hits. Wow, that shit's it's all the hits. You're absolutely right. Not know that compilation compilation you're so mispronouncing sorry. <laughs> so, so, compilations so sorry. brother so sorry. Compilations. Not. Yeah. all right hey, well nothing like going out on a whimper and that's another episode of <laughs> this, this is, is important. Important.